are you an introvert like me? Then you should uh, watch this video. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. What's up, guys? Welcome back to According to Kaya. I'm Kaya, of course. And today I like to call this video Chit Chat. No, get ready with me because, as I've stated previously, I don't do makeup or anything fashion beauty related. So, we're just gonna cut off the get ready with me part and we're just gonna chit chat. If you can tell by the title, I'm an introvert. Are you surprised? That's not a rhetorical question. I'm genuinely wondering if you're surprised. So, I wrote about this on my blog, which you can find a link down in the description box below, according to Kaya, same as my YouTube channel. But now, um, I'm going to make a video about it because why not? So here's six reasons why I love and hate, um, what we're going to say, bothered with, strongly, um, don't necessarily like <laughs> about being an introvert. So, um, yeah, keep watching. If you're an introvert like me, um, yeah, I like to be alone a lot and people don't understand that, but I like to be by myself 60% of the time. It's what I prefer. Like, if I can be just in my own solitude, in my own space, I really appreciate that. Like, I value my alone time. It really helps me connect with myself, if that makes sense. Like, it's just like, if you're an introvert, you understand what it means, like, to recharge, and I need that a little time to recharge. Like, if I go out with a group of people, I have to come back to my room for days and just be by myself because it, everybody's taking, it's taking energy out of me to just interact with people and just interact with the, uh, the world, you know what I'm saying? Like, it, it takes a lot of me. So I value my alone time. Like a lot. Another thing that I love about being an introvert is I'm a good listener. At least I would, I think I am. I think I'm a pretty great listener. And I'm also very observant so I notice a lot of things. Which is a good and bad thing because I start to, you know, like overanalyze things. But I'm a good listener so if my friends just want to, you know, vent to me, um, always going to be there. I don't have a problem with just sitting and listening. I like to observe things. I like to take things in and then speak later. Like, you know how people just like blur stuff out and you're just like, fam, like, you should probably should have thought about that before you said it. I, I think about things most of the time before I say them. So, you know, I'm pretty, I'm a pretty good listener. Friendships are important to me and as an introvert, um, Maybe it's just me, but I have a really hard, not a really hard time. Like, I'm not socially awkward. I can be awkward, but like, I know how to talk to people. But as an introvert, my, me being quiet or shy kind of makes it hard for me to just like be outgoing and just go talk and make bunches, bunches, make a bunch of friends. So I've always had like a really tight knit group of friends, like, <clears throat> My friends that I have, like we here, like it's just our circle of us. It's like four or five. I have four or five best friends, and that's how I've always had it. And I know those are like always going to be close knit relationships with each one of them. So that's really cool with being an introvert is I don't run in a large circle. I never had, and I don't care anymore. I used to care back in high school because like you know like it's high school, like you I don't know. But now I don't care. Like I have my small group of friends. I love them and. Yeah. One to the things that I don't necessarily like about being an introvert. People love to ask me why I'm so quiet. And I would just love to ask them why they don't ever stop talking because <laughs> like it's not that I'm quiet. It's just that I don't want to talk around you. I'm never really talking around you. It's probably because I, I probably don't particularly care for you or you know. I'm just not really getting a good vibe, so you won't get to see my full personality, which is pretty awesome. But um, yeah, um, I'm not, I'm not actually quiet. I just don't talk around certain people. So uh, yeah, one thing that people um say to me, well, I, I guess I've gotten this from girls like growing up in school is like, girl, like I thought you was gonna be stuck up and. You know, when I first met you and blah, 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 I don't know why I come off as 
um, stuck up or standoffish when I meet new people. That's not it at all. I'm just an introvert, and it's really, it's really easy for me to go into my shell, and it's hard for me to just be that person that just goes and talks to anybody. So I'm not stuck up, and I'm not standoffish. I am just an introvert, and that's kind of how I operate sometimes. As I get older, I know, like, you know, like, it's okay to, like, go up and talk to people, but it's still kind of like, I don't know, it's, I don't know. Another thing, as an introvert, this is reason number six, is even though I love being an introvert, and it's been cool, well, I didn't always like being an introvert. I honestly was jealous of people that were extroverts and were just loud and outgoing until I realized that um, not everybody likes that, so um, I'm going to stick to the way I am. But sometimes, you know, you feel like you're stifled by your introvertedness, so like, here's the box of introversion and I'm stuck in that box sometimes like I will want to go out and then I make plans to go out and then um, I think about the energy that I'm gonna lose from going out and I choose to stay in my bed so I really do deep down in my soul want to go out but um, that introversion just gets in the way and I'm just stuck in the box you know what I'm saying anyway um that's pretty much it I didn't want to make this video too long for all my introverts out there leave a comment down in the description box below telling me if you can relate telling me some other things that you you know notice notice um about like being an introvert things that you notice about yourself if you're not an introvert um that's cool too leave a comment about being an extrovert or what's the other one uh ambivert or um i think that's what it's called i don't know um anyway that's the end of this video thanks for watching don't forget to like comment share and subscribe to my channel like i said my link to my blog is in the description box so you can read about what i just um said out loud to you in this video um yeah so thanks for watching you guys i'll see you in the next video be great and um yeah that's it bye